Philadelphia police have made an arrest in the stabbing death of Ms. Dolores Robinson. She was 83. Police are charging her neighbor, 47-year-old Isaiah Rahat, with murder. That stabbing on the 2900 block of North 27th Street in North Philadelphia. CBS Philadelphia's Ray Strickland has the details and reaction from a friend who says they knew her for decades. Very quiet, didn't bother nobody. Just a sweet person. Neighbors living on North 27th Street in North Philadelphia are heartbroken after the murder of 83 year old Dolores Robinson. I miss her so much. A neighbor we spoke to couldn't hold back the tears as she talked to us about their friendship of 50 years. The woman didn't want to go on camera, but she felt compelled to tell us about Robinson, who she described as a caring, kind, and nice woman. All I want is no, you to know. That she was a very sweet person, a very good neighbor, just like a sister. I, I couldn't find no better person. The man accused of killing Robinson is now in police custody. 47 year old Isaiah Rahat, who is Robinson's neighbor, is facing multiple charges, including murder. Isaiah exited his home, again, their neighbors, and followed her inside her, to her home. While inside Ms. Robinson's house, a struggle ensued. Eventually, they ended up back on Ms. Robinson's porch, where she was fatally stabbed in the neck and shot with a BB gun. Ernest Ransom with Philadelphia Police says officers were called to the area of the stabbing several times in the past after neighbors complained about Rahat. It's unclear if Robinson was one of the neighbors who called. Robinson's friend says she didn't know if the two had any issues, but she says there's nothing Robinson could have done to deserve this. I just don't know why. I don't know why. It's nothing I can do, but because she's gone. And police say Rahat has a history of violence, including being arrested in 2023 on aggravated assault charges. Right now, it's unclear if he and Miss Robinson had issues in the past. Reporting outside of Philadelphia Police Headquarters, Ray Strickland, CBS News, Philadelphia.